Hello everybody, welcome to episode 5 of Locomotion. As you can see, now we have some high-rise buildings developing here. And, well, I kind of want to restore a link between here and here, so I'm going to go quickly make a little bridge. Now, after I make this, uh, we will, of course... Oh wait, I already have the thing with the trucks, I don't need to... So after we do this, we will then, of course, expand the main line a little bit. We shall expand it down to Martinhead and Brokenton. That way we can get some lovely wheat and f extra food. We also have this area down here. It's Birdhead Vineyard at 1947. Until then, it's basically an army camp. So, I just wanted to add in you know, a little bit of history beforehand. So then, have a curve around like that. And I'm thinking of where we should place the Brokenton station, since, well, all this, you know, track going through, it's going to disrupt all of these farms. So I kind of want it to be elevated off the ground. Plus, there's definitely going to be a big yard for this food processing plant, so we're going to have to do it anyways. to basically allow for, you know, some space for it to be. We would now accept food. Hmm. And I think maybe we could arrive into Flintwood. Oh, and we are out of money. Let's just fast forward a bit. So we're at 1904, we're at year 4, in level, in episode 5. Thinking maybe by the end of this episode we'd be in 19... Maybe 1906, who knows. I think we should just stop here in Flintwood for a little bit of money collection. Be here. Might be a bit controversial with Flintwood, but oh well. Actually... That looks a bit better. Now we have a little embankment for the trains to head on. And these trains. Soon going to head into the soon going to be city of Alton. But I have a plan with this bridge. Okay. No, nope, we cannot do that. Okay. We're gonna have to do that. Then up. We cannot do that either. Oh dear. I'm trying to get. Railway to go underneath. Yes, there we go. Railway heading underneath the bridge. Like that. And we're out of money. Let's fast forward. Three thousand looks like enough. And I think we can have a terminus there for our railway. To Walton. Maybe later on we'll have a bit more of a system here in Alton. But for now, it's kind of just a little link. Actually, I can have the curved. Oh, yes. And lovely. And we've run out of money. Goodwood now accepts goods as well. Turning into some pretty big towns, I gotta say. And okay. Yep. 
Ta-da! Uh, what station? I think maybe the British style. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. But I hear you asking, how are we going to have the crossover? This just goes to the middle. But aha! Ta-da! Now... We need more money! Then cross over... It's gonna be kinda hard to signal now that I think about it. Oh dear, I will kinda see it. Their little... Uh, arrows, yeah. I think I'm just going to go ahead and signal this area beforehand so we don't have to go through the nightmare of doing it later on. Okay. Now we're going to use our remaining episode time to try and finish off the other track. Nope, that's the wrong bridge. We're also going to have to replace that level crossing later on with, on with like gates and all that when it hits 1945. Is it? Yeah, 1945. Well, actually, the, oh, the American modern crossing doesn't have gates, but it does have... Uh, you know, lights. The European one, when you get to 1950, does. We're nearly out of time. Nearly out of time. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. We're gonna have big rail yards here at Brokenton to carry the wheat over to Martinhead and then probably also a lot of big yards at Martinhead to take the food off to, you know, other cities. Okay, and quickly, oh, and we've reached eight minutes. So we will signal this later. Goodbye!